Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Manifesting Dream Body Masterclass. I'm your host, Tara, from Tara Brunette Mindset, and today I'm going to be sharing with you how to combine intuitive eating with manifestation and mindset principles so you can effortlessly shift into your dream body without dieting or strict regimes of any form. I am all about total food freedom for the rest of your life and living in a body you absolutely love. If you have tried absolutely everything in terms of dieting and exercise and have been struggling for a while, please just stick with me and maintain an open mind because I'm going to be sharing some things with you today that are very different from what most people are talking about in the health and wellness industry. And if you feel really hesitant that you could actually have all foods and live in your dream body, I'm truly, I'm here to teach you how to begin and to start learning that you and your body are on the same team and want the same thing. Weight loss doesn't have to be hard and restrictive, and it's all just the programming we have received throughout our lifetime that have made it that way. I'll be teaching you some tricks in today's class that will help you start to change your brain and see results in your body. I'll be the first to tell you that I spent forever trying to figure this out, and when it all clicked, I saw results in a way that felt like it happened overnight, and this is available for you as well. You'll also hear from some of my clients who have had the same experience. Also, definitely stick around till the end. I'll have a special discount for you guys and a bundle that is not available anywhere else and let you know where to head next if you want to learn more. I have so many dream body and intuitive eating resources for you to check out. You might be wondering if this training is right for you and if what I have to say is relevant to your situation. So. If you are currently living in a body that you don't absolutely love, then this training is definitely going to get you on the path to feeling incredible in your body, but most of all free from the torment and struggle around food. If you've been on and off diets your entire life or struggling with binge eating and overeating or emotional eating, then this masterclass is absolutely essential for you. And I'm so excited to dive into the principles of intuitive eating with you and help you see the level of freedom and happiness that is available to you. No more planning meals, feeling restricted or overthinking every food decision that you make. If you're sick of dieting and the roller coaster of weight loss and weight gain, then this is also the perfect place to be because I want you to get off the roller coaster once and for all and spend the rest of your life never giving food a second thought and live in a body you feel confident and amazing in. Basically, if you just want to let go of the food struggle, let it be easy and experience weight loss the way it's meant to be experienced in an effortless, enjoyable way without forcing it, then you are in the right place. Before we get into the bulk of today's training, I just want to introduce myself and let you know how I got here. I'm Tara Burnett, and I'm a mindset and manifestation teacher specializing in the area of dream body. I'm a 1-3 projector in human design, which means I'm really meant to experiment with different things and take my experiences and teach them, which is exactly why I'm sharing this with you today, because I have gone through this entire process. It took me a long time to figure this out, and now I've condensed it um, so that you can do it quickly and easily. And I'm also happily married to my soulmate, which we have a pretty crazy story. I met him and then we were engaged within two weeks <laughs> and it's kind of a whole other story. I definitely manifested him and I'm about to be a mom. I'm over 41 weeks pregnant today. So if I'm out of breath during this training, um, that is why. <laughs> and my husband and I are currently renovating our dream van so we can adventure and travel with our two cats and dog and our son. I'm also a previous personal trainer and clinical nutritionist. I used to own a gym, which is how my business began. And even though I don't subscribe to the things I used to in terms of training and nutrition, I have a really large area of expertise in this field in general. So I've spent my whole life surrounded by fitness and nutrition and now manifestation and mindset. My eating and body story begins at an early age when I developed binge eating and bulimia, and this went on for the bulk of my life, around 17 years. 
I was constantly trying to lose weight and constantly failing. <laughs> I would spend days in bed binge eating and avoiding everyone. I tried absolutely every diet and workout routine possible. I was obsessed with losing weight, which is why I became a personal trainer and a nutritionist in the first place because I was constantly searching for the secret to being in my dream body. Like I just thought my life would be perfect once I was figured this out and I was constantly coming up short. And this went on for a long time until I discovered intuitive eating. And intuitive eating was developed by Elise Rash and Evelyn Triboli, who are two registered dietitians that teach you how to quit dieting forever, learn to tune into your natural hunger and fullness signals, and learn to really listen to your body and find food freedom. And I highly recommend this book or my 10-day intuitive eating challenge inside the membership goes deep into all of these steps. And this book absolutely changed my life and the way that I viewed food forever, but as I entered into the body positive space and learned more and more, there was one thing that just really wasn't kind of clicking with me. This community is quite anti weight loss and I found it actually to really demonize any form of wanting to change your body. And don't get me wrong, I am all for body positivity, all the self love, and this is a huge part of my manifesting dream body course, but I felt very stuck. I felt that I could either have one or the other. I could have food freedom and live in a body that I didn't feel very comfortable in and just accept that and find peace with it. Or I could diet and restrict and live in a body that I did enjoy, but obviously was miserable. And I really kind of veered between these two for a long time until I finally committed wholeheartedly to intuitive eating and body positivity and body acceptance but I felt like there was more available to me. Like neither of those things felt right to me. I felt like we could have it all. So I, this led me into a huge aha moment. Um, I was already into manifestation and mindset and using it towards my dream business and increasing my income and so many other things, but I hadn't applied it to body yet. And this is when I created my own practice around combining intuitive eating with the mindset and manifestation principles and reprogramming the subconscious mind because I wanted it all. And I'm sure because you're here, you do as well. I wanted total food freedom, no rules, no restrictions, and a body that I felt totally amazing in. And nobody was talking about this as if it was possible. So I learned everything I possibly could around the subconscious mind, the metaphysical and the body and put it all together into my manifesting dream body program. And the results were insane. <laughs> After years of struggling, I truly did experience effortless weight loss, 35 pounds and completely healed my relationship with food, which was the biggest thing. And my clients have incredible stories around doing the same. I'll never forget the day I randomly stepped on a scale in Walmart because at this point I no longer owned a scale or cared about my weight and I had already had like a big burger and fries for lunch. I was just out enjoying the day with my partner and I was 120 pounds fully clothed. And those of you that may be slaves to the scale are probably how I used to be and would never step on the scale unless it's first thing in the morning after you've gone to the bathroom and removed every ounce of clothing. So I was totally shocked. I knew that I was in my dream body, but that was the weight that I always dreamed of. And when I was younger, I never even got close to in all of my dieting years, no matter what I did. So it was just really further evidence for me that this works. And this is a thousand percent available to you as well. After that, I was obsessed with getting the message out there and changing the narrative around food and body because after years of being in the personal training industry and being a nutritionist, I knew how many people struggled with food and their bodies. And I finally realized the key piece that they were missing is that their beliefs were shaping their bodies, not the food and exercise they were doing. In fact, this kind of principle resonated with me so much and changed my life so much that I got it tattooed on my arm become what you believe. So regardless of where you are starting, no matter how long you have struggled or where you are in your journey, a body you are just obsessed with is available to you as well without cutting out foods and forcing your body into submission with workouts that you hate. And I want you guys to meet Sydney. I love Sydney's story because I actually, I worked with her one-on-one -on -one and she was very skeptical at first. In fact, I actually met with her 
I think one or two years earlier when she was still very entrenched in the dieting mentality and I it was triggering for her to like even hear that she could like eat more and I was trying to get her to eat more um but she came back later and it once she truly trusted and adopted the principles that I teach, she saw incredible results after giving birth, no less. Um, so she says, the dream body came unexpectedly after I gave birth to my daughter. After I gave birth, maybe three weeks postpartum, I had to weigh myself at the midwife and I was exactly what I visualized and always wanted my body to be. I have definition in my arms, my legs. I've got this body that I've dreamed of. It's crazy. It was really surreal and you don't hear of things like that. And I think it's because I truly loved my body. And this is an excerpt from episode 118 on my podcast. You can hear her whole story there and it is incredibly inspiring. So can you imagine just being in a body that you feel totally free in while no longer worrying about or thinking about food all the time? Just moving your body when you feel like it because it feels good and being able to focus on other things. This was a huge piece of my own journey because I felt like 95% of my brain space and my life was consumed with weight loss and what to eat next and counting calories and always so stressed about what to wear and what I looked like. So just imagine how much space you would open up in your life if this was no longer an issue. Imagine what you would be able to accomplish or how much more present you could be with your family, your friendships, your kids, and how much more enjoyable each day would be when you are no longer focused on weight loss and easily maintain a body that feels amazing. So let's dive in on how to get started with intuitive eating and begin your path to food freedom. Inside Manifesting Dream Body, I go over all of the principles of intuitive eating in detail, but today I wanted to go over these two key principles that really started my journey, which is rejecting the dieting mentality and making peace with food. And you really do need to be ready to let go of diets and restriction for good and start viewing all food as neutral before you kind of start the step. The way we view food is in fact like taking a placebo pill for how it reacts in your body. Did you know that if you consider a food as high fat, um, high calorie, and ingest it, your ghrelin levels drop about three times more than if you thought you were consuming a low calorie food, even if it's the same food. Ghrelin is the hunger hormone and also slows down your metabolism. So they did a study on this with milkshakes where they labeled them differently and how people perceived them determined how they were digested and what hormones were released in the body afterwards, which really is insane. <laughs> Our beliefs have massive influence over our bodies from the foods we choose to how they react in the body and how our bodies look depending on our beliefs around the foods we choose. <laughs> My whole concept behind manifesting dream body is that it's not the diet or workout regime that causes you to lose the weight. It's your belief that you will lose weight on it that triggers the weight loss. I've had hundreds of clients in my career as a personal trainer and nutritionist and one person would come in believing so much in my plan and workout that they would drop 50 plus pounds when they even tripling their daily calorie intake. Then I had people come in who didn't fully trust the process, but trained diligently and followed the meal plan, but they had the story in their mind that this wouldn't work for them. And of course they saw zero results. So obviously I don't believe in meal plans or any type of exercise regimes anymore, but the wide variety of diets and meal plans that are out there that work like magic for some, and not at all for others really shows that it's not about the food or there would be one magic way of eating that would work for everybody. So the first step to your food freedom journey is to recognize that it's not the food that is causing your results or lack of results and really notice the meaning you are giving food. What are you believing is going to cause weight loss or weight gain? What behaviors are you engaging in that you believe are hindering weight loss? Now in the normal world, they would say you need to change those behaviors. But in the manifesting dream body world, I teach you how to change your perceptions of those behaviors. So starting to really believe that everything is leading you to your dream body. Working out less can lead you to your dream body. Eating more can lead you to your dream body. Allowing all foods can lead you into your dream body. It's about changing your old beliefs into ones that actually support you. So making peace with food is a huge piece of intuitive eating. And that means viewing all foods as neutral. An apple isn't any better or worse than a slice of apple pie. Chocolate isn't any better or worse than kale. All foods are energy and it's how you are perceiving those foods that is determining your results. A 
good way to see this in action is to think about all the foods you might not allow yourself to keep in the house. These are foods that you have negative connotations with. Either you believe you will overeat on them, you can't trust yourself with them, or they are quote unquote bad for you. So inside Manifesting Dream Body, we spend a lot of time neutralizing foods, filling your house with foods that you don't think you can trust yourself with in a really safe way, and really retraining your subconscious mind to not view these foods any differently than any other foods. By the time you graduate from Manifesting Dream Body, you'll be able to have ice cream, chips, cookies, and chocolate in your house and actually forget it's there. I remember the first time this happened to me and I was actually shocked. I was the person that would obsessively think about the ice cream in the freezer and eat all two liters of it in one sitting just to get rid of it. Now it can live in there until it gets freezer burn and I throw it out. <laughs> Intuitive eating has many different facets from honoring hunger and fullness, finding satisfaction in food, coping with emotions, respecting your body, movement, and gentle nutrition. The nutrition aspect isn't brought into manifesting dream body until the very end. And I have a specific process to help you introduce foods that feel good without it turning into any form of dieting, shooting yourself or restriction. I promise that you can see long-term forever results without having to stick to any plans, avoid any foods or restrict yourself in any way. That is the most important thing that to me that everyone who goes through the program experiences. Everyone meet Brie. Brie is amazing. Um, she says, I have a completely different relationship with food, working out and myself, and I lost over 20 pounds. I work out less and eat whatever I want. Now I enjoy seeing my reflection and getting dressed and have stopped having my first thoughts every morning be about how much I hate my body. I no longer stress and obsess about my next meals and workouts, and I'm able to finally have freedom. I can appreciate my beauty and listen to my hunger and energy levels for the first time. And I also worked with Brie one-on-one -on -one and her transformation was just incredible. You can read um, more about her story inside or on the, on the sales page of the page that you're watching this webinar on. She talks about her whole story and it's amazing. So each week of Manifesting Dream Body covers an intuitive eating principle and then a manifestation and mindset principle. We have briefly covered how beliefs can shape your body, which we spend a lot of time on inside the course from hunger beliefs to food beliefs to exercise beliefs. We are going to start shifting them one by one. And once you change your beliefs, you can truly become free and make your own rules for how this gets to go for you. So let's play with that. In an absolute dream world, if you could have weight loss, your body, food, work any way that you desired, how would it go for you? I remember pondering this and deciding that my ultimate dream would be to live in my dream body and eat whatever I wanted without worrying about perfect portion sizes or having to work it off or weigh my food or count calories. And I can truly tell you that that is absolutely my reality. And it is the same for so many others that have gone through the MDB course. If you got to decide how it all went, what would your dream reality with food and exercise be? And then know that this is absolutely available to you and this is what we will create and reprogram your subconscious mind around within the Manifesting Dream Body course. In order to reprogram the subconscious mind, one of my favorite tools is visualization. Visualization is incredibly powerful for the body and has been proven in so many studies. I go deep into all these studies inside the course, but they, one of my favorite studies is they did a study between two groups, one who visualized doing bicep exercises three times a week and one that actually did the exercises three times a week. And the difference in building strength was only 4%. The group that worked out three times a week gained 28% strength, muscle mass. The group that visualized gained 24%. The power of our mind is completely unparalleled and I teach you how to use that to your advantage inside MDB. And when we visualize, we start effectively shifting our subconscious mind because it doesn't know the difference between reality and imagination. So if you can visualize your dream body, you start showing your subconscious what your body quote unquote is. Then you have your subconscious working overtime for you to make that a reality. And of course, your subconscious is handling your hormones, hunger, cravings, metabolism, muscle building, fat loss, digestion, everything. So instead of trying to force your body into submission through diets and workouts, you can visualize it into effortless weight loss. 
And my tip for that is to start seeing your body in first person how you'd like it to be. I found the most effective way to do this was to visualize myself in the mirror getting dressed in the morning, or I used to visualize myself wearing shorts and a sports bra, working out um, in a class, something that I could have never dreamed would be possible for me. And it quickly did become my reality. Shifting into your dream body is truly available to absolutely everyone. It doesn't matter how old you are, how long you have struggled, or how many different things you have tried. If you are willing to put in the work with this program and commit to a new way of being with food in your body, you will absolutely see the results you desire. It's just completely different from any other program because we're changing your core beliefs in order to change your results. It takes dedication and willingness to start seeing things differently, but if you can give yourself that grace and time to start changing your thoughts first and allow things to shift, you will live the rest of your life free from the roller coaster of food torture and in a body that you feel incredible in. And this is Colette. Um, she is just more great evidence. She says, this is a brilliant program. Yesterday, I hit my lowest weight since my teens. She is now 53, so age is not a factor. I feel so free, just enjoying life and taking each day as it comes. I love throwing out everything I've ever read or heard and making my own rules. So much fun. I trust my body and I've learned to listen to my hunger signals. It took ages for my satiety signal to kick in and it's not yet perfect, but I try again the next day and don't let myself get guilty or worse yet, punish myself for it. You won't be disappointed. It's not a quick fix, but a permanent solution. So if you are finally ready to stop obsessing over food and workouts and enjoy all foods guilt-free and open up all that time and space in your life, then MDB was created for you. If you're ready to let it be easy, effortless, and live in a body that you love and feel proud of every single day and just throw on clothes that feel great without a second thought, Manifesting Dream Body was created for you. But I know what you're thinking right now. <laughs> you are thinking, okay, I'll just try this last diet and workout plan and lose X amount of pounds and then I will start intuitive eating. And I'm on to you because I did this for years. I can tell you that even if you do manage to lose weight on this next miracle plan, it won't last and you will be back looking at this course in another four to six months after you've gained it back, probably plus a little more. And I know because I've been there. We want the quick fix, but the problem with the quick fix is that it requires more quick fixes again and again. I want you to live the rest of your life in your dream body without a second thought. I want food to no longer be an issue for you ever. I want you to stop the cycle of weight loss and weight gain and always fixating on the next thing because it's never going to work long term. I've seen so many women put off this course for another six months to a year only to come back and wish they just started sooner. The sooner you can commit to this program, the sooner you will, you will be done with the vicious cycle once and for all, and the sooner you can never think about this stuff again and actually go live your life. So I encourage you, if Manifesting Dream Body is speaking to your soul, go all in, commit, and I would absolutely love to aid you on your journey to food freedom and your dream body. And just a quick little kind of sneak peek into what we cover inside. So each week includes an intuitive eating principle combined with mindset and manifestation, a self-love section, and a guided meditation and hypnosis to listen to. So week one, we open your eyes to where dieting has got you and I get you to look back at your journey and really reject the dieting mentality and say goodbye once and for all. We go through my step-by-step -step manifestation process in regards to dream body and start dreaming big and getting intentional about where you will be at the end of this course. We start challenging the beliefs and hear from a quote unquote naturally thin person and see how our beliefs compare. And this is typically quite mind blowing for people. We get really clear on you 2.0 and how to start becoming the version of you that is already in her dream body now. And each week there's a self-love section included where we focus on incorporating all aspects of self-love, loving and celebrating you. So you can start to feel great now, not in 10, 15 or 20 pounds from now. And the dream body meditation takes you through the perfect process to start changing your subconscious from day one. Week two is where you learn all about hunger, how to identify it, honor it, and also not go into fear and panic around it, which is something that a lot of us with a dieting history have in common. 
You also start changing your beliefs around hunger and get a copy of the hunger and fullness scale to start using. We continue the work on beliefs and creating new ones that we want to live by that aid us in our effortless dream body journey. And the self-love section this week may bring up some very powerful emotions for you. We begin to do some mirror work, something that is not everyone enjoys at first, but is a key step to transforming how you view your body. And you also get the weight loss switch hypnosis that is effectively turning on weight loss in your subconscious through a powerful guided hypnosis session. In week three, we start making peace with food and I get you to stock up in a way that feels safe for you. It is a fun week. We identify your forbidden foods and examine the thoughts and emotions that come up for you when you eat them so you can start changing how you view them and therefore how they are reacting in your body. I teach you how to get into alignment with the dream body version of you so you can start seeing immediate shifts in your reality and emotions regardless of where your body currently is. We go deep into the placebo effect. This is so powerful for really shifting your brain around manifesting dream body and seeing how powerful your mind is and what it can do. And in the self-love section, we start shifting self-talk, which is a huge part of manifestation. And you have a guided visualization meditation to utilize this week, which is another powerful practice to shift the subconscious. In week four, we dive into learning about fullness, which is something that a lot of us have struggled with. This was the hardest part for me. I was either always feeling overly full because I was in the restriction binge cycle or never quite feeling satisfied because I never let myself get to that point. So we learn to find true satisfaction and eat to a comfortable fullness that feels good all around this week. We also go deeper into visualization and discuss healing your body with your mind from injury to illness. I really believe in the mind's powerful effect it has on the body, and I teach you some techniques to heal your body, which I used um, to heal from a very debilitating back injury. I was um, injured for about two years. I was told I would never run again, and I needed to quit my job as a trainer, and I went on to heal my back and run a marathon um, a little bit later, which was really powerful for me. We discussed the practice of forgiveness, um, letting go of past stories and trauma around our bodies or our families. Through forgiveness, you can let them go once and for all. And finally, feel free from past stories or comments that may be ruminating in your mind and holding you back. And along with that practice is a guided forgiveness meditation to aid you in this process. And it has been a big game changer for people in the course. Week five, we tackle binge eating. We change your mindset around it and begin the healing journey of releasing binge eating as a coping mechanism. And this week is very near and dear to my heart because I struggled with binge eating for so, so long. It was the biggest block to my happiness and felt like something that was constantly on my mind and I felt completely out of control. I share everything I've learned along the way of healing from binge eating disorder and how to apply it to your own journey so you can be free from it once and for all if this is something that you struggle with. We discuss satisfaction and finding joy and satisfaction from all the foods that you eat. No more boring, plain salads around here. We decide the rules this week as we discussed in this class and another powerful self-love practice that will bring tears to your eyes. And your hypnosis this week addresses finding safety in weight loss. So often we have blocks and fears around weight loss because we don't actually feel safe to lose the weight. We might think that it'll separate us from our family or our friendships with people who we may have been on this weight loss struggle together, but we kind of commiserate with. And there's lots of different ways that this can crop up for you. Um, but this week's guided audio will begin the process of letting your subconscious know it's totally safe for you to lose weight and you can let go of those fears forever. Week six, we're diving into exercise. Whether you love it or hate it, we discuss finding movement that feels great to you, but know that exercise is not a requirement for weight loss or for your dream body journey. Movement is just a way to invigorate and energize your body and should be done in a way that feels joyful and good through and through. We change your relationship with exercise, but also take away the rules around movement. So it doesn't matter which camp you fall into, you can live in your dream body for life regardless. We also discuss manifestation morning rituals and the self-love section this week is a powerful practice in releasing old stories around weight, body, food, and exercise so you can move forward with freedom and excitement for whatever is coming next for you. And the guided audio is a quick practice to help you get into, into the vibes before a workout, get intentional, how you want to feel, creating an affirmation, and really changing how movement feels for you. 
Week seven, we learn about how to cope with your emotions without using food. So if you've struggled with binge eating or emotional eating, I teach you how to move through emotions in a new way that will have you recognizing your power over your own emotions and releasing them. I struggled with anxiety for years and have been able to transform my relationship with my emotions through these practices that I teach um, in this week. And we dive into self-sabotage. Whether it's coming up consciously or unconsciously, such as injuries, sickness, just weird things that you're manifesting that are prohibiting you from your results and how to eliminate it. We also make a dream body board that is another powerful practice for your subconscious and get into some pampering self-love. And I also provide you with some dream body mantras to listen to as you fall asleep for reprogramming the mind and a powerful dream body rampage to listen to in the morning to get into the dream body vibes. In week eight, we finally introduce nutrition, but not in the way that you would think. I teach you my powerful process to recognize how food makes you feel. We discuss time and how it is really irrelevant in your dream body, dream body journey and how you can experience weight loss in what feels like overnight. And your hypnosis this week will supercharge your metabolism and turn your body into a fat burning machine. And week nine is all about maintaining your dream body. You finally found total food freedom and have your dream body for life. Now what? There isn't really much to do, to be honest, but I did create a module one year later discussing our beliefs around weight set points, the story we're telling on our weight and body and dive into some incredibly powerful journaling, journaling practices that can really be applied to anything. And just ensuring that maintaining your dream body is the easiest thing ever. And then week 10 is a bonus week all about dream body and pregnancy. So we discuss all things, body changes during pregnancy, continuing to maintain your pregnant dream body, manifesting away morning sickness. Obviously, I only have my own experience um, and it worked for me. I truly had zero pregnancy symptoms. I had a very easy pregnancy aside from a sore hip that I think I manifested just to complain about something to my husband and have him massage me every night. Um, and we talk about easily falling back into your dream body post-pregnancy, which I will be doing some probably bonus live streams on that as I'm about to enter that journey soon. So I'm so, so excited. There's so many negative connotations between body and pregnancy, and I'm here to show you that it absolutely doesn't have to be that way. And in fact, it can feel amazing through and through. So just a reminder that I am not special and this dream body journey is available to everyone. I teach you absolutely everything I know, and I don't hold back over the 10 modules in this course. With Manifesting Dream Body, you also receive access to a private Facebook group to connect with everyone else along the Dream Body journey with you. So you can ask me questions anytime and receive support with whatever you are struggling with. I am here for you. You also have lifetime access to this course and any new updates that come out in this lifetime. Thank you so much for staying until the end. As a special thank you, I have a little discount and a bundle option for you guys. So if you are interested in continuing your dream body journey, my manifesting dream body course at regular price is 1300 USD, or you can purchase it on a three month payment plan for 466 a month. The deal I have for you guys is two options. You can get the 10 week course at $412 off just for watching this class for 888, just a pay in full option only. Or you can get the Manifesting Dream Body course as well as one year inside my membership for $9.99, which is saving you $700. Inside the membership, you have a ton of additional Dream Body resources you can dive into, such as the 10 Day Intuitive Eating Challenge, the Dream Body Reset Livestream event, the Dream Body Blueprint, and access to so many more hypnosis and meditation specifically for Dream Body. You also have access to my entire workout video library, which is 300 workout videos that can be done anywhere, anytime, all around 20 minutes or less. I love short and effective workouts. So if you enjoy working out and my energy, you really will love my outside the box workouts. They have so much variety and I have so many challenges in there, such as like the 14 day love your body challenge and fitness, which is 25 days of workouts in an advent calendar. So again, you have two options save $412 um, for the full class or bundle it inside the membership and save 700 and get access to a ton of additional resources. I didn't even mention all of the manifestation resources. There is like endless resources on inside the membership and it's constantly updated. 
So there's always new trainings every single month, new meditations every single week. You can request meditations. Um, there's just tons in there. So either way, you have the Dream Body course and all updates for life. So I hope to see you guys inside. I cannot wait for you to experience total food freedom and your dream body for the rest of your life and create the life you've always envisioned for yourself.